She cringed, as if she expected a blow. As if she expected I was going to... strike her. And I asked her where she was whipped, and how many times. And she stated that she was whipped every morning with a rawhide on different parts of the body. She showed the marks where she had been struck. And I hear the story of little Mary Ellen told again that stirred the soul of a city and roused the consciousness of a world that had forgotten. And so I looked. I knew I was where the first chapter of children's rights was written, under warrant of that made for the dog. I do hereby order that the said child, Mary Ellen, be released, discharged, and taken from the custody and control of the said Mary Connolly. Dear Sir, Mrs. Wheeler, the excellent lady who was instrumental in aiding me in rescuing little Mary Ellen from the hands of a brutal woman, has called to see me in relation to procuring her a home with her sister, who resides near Rochester in this state. For the first time in her life, she's unrestrained by bolts and locks, and she enjoys being out of doors as an escaped soul would paradise. She is a helpful, kind-hearted little creature and is making friends for herself. <laughs>